Days of heavy rain caused catastrophic floods in Hawaii this week, forcing residents to evacuate, roads closed and houses destroyed. According to forecasts, the threat of heavy rain will last at least until Wednesday or even longer. Widespread showers, some locally heavy, are expected statewide through Wednesday as a slow-moving low-pressure system lingers west of Kauai, the National Weather Service said. With the low remaining nearby for the next couple of days, light south winds will prevail and the potential for showers will remain elevated. The entire state remained under a flash flood watch as of Wednesday afternoon. The island of Kauai and part of the Big Island of Hawaii were under a flash flood warning. An evacuation order for hundreds of residents from Haleiwa, a town north of Honolulu, was lifted late Tuesday as the threat of flooding from torrential rains subsided, according to Hawaii News Now. Nearly two feet of rain has fallen this week in Wahiawa on Oahu, AccuWeather said. Some places have picked up a half month's worth of rain in only one day. On Monday, officials initially thought that the Kapakalua Dam in the Maui community of Haiku was breached by floodwaters, but after careful inspection, county officials determined that there was no structural damage. About six homes on Maui and two bridges were heavily damaged or destroyed, Maui County Mayor Michael Victorino's office said, this has been unprecedented flooding, Victorino said in a statement. On the Big Island, in addition to the rain at lower elevations, snow also was forecast to fall on the highest summits of Mauna Kea and Mauna Loa, where a winter weather advisory was in effect, the Weather Service said.